嘟嘟嘟嘟。Hello, hello. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, guys. So today, let's talk about some woo woo money shit, shall we? I'm not sure if you know, I'm a money coach, and I'm super super woo woo. What does it mean by woo woo? I love anything spiritual, alien, weird, crystal, sound healing bowl, essential oil. This guy. So anything like quantum, love attractions, woo woo stuff, like out there, out there. I like woo woo. Can make you money. If you would like to learn more, let's keep going and watch. And if this is somehow going to YouTube, then、uh, click the like and share and comment and subscribe, please. Today, let's talk about what kind of wallet will make you more money. Who want to know? Who want to know? So excited! I have been using like a small, short, mini wallet for my whole life until I learned you actually meant to have a long wallet, right? So now, finally, this year, I decided to really get myself a long wallet. In fact, I got myself two, so not just one, because I make some money from crypto. So I spoil myself because otherwise, I wouldn't justify myself to change my wallet every two, three years. Usually, a wallet will last me I don't know eight to ten. Years, so yes, I always buy kind of luxury, expensive wallet because it will last me for ten years, right? So if you think about it, like if this wallet is two k, but you use for ten years, this one is not ten years. I think it's maybe probably five, right? If it's still five years, still really nice and strong because it is a good quality leather make. So like for example, right, my husband. I won't say he like cheap wallet, but the brand that he like is like surfing skateboard kind of street brand. So he always buy the wallet that is not like leather, which is like maybe fabric or plastic, and they just fall apart in a year or two. And so you might as well just invest like better quality wallet. So I've been using a lot of traction for a long while, and I know that your your money is meant to not not to be folded. However, this wallet will fold your money, and this one was the last time that I used. So right, so what I did was oh I got a band. Day here. Actually, don't put band aid in your wallet anymore because that means you're subconsciously ready to get injured, hurt yourself, a little cat or paper cat or something that you need a band aid. So. <laughs> Fuck bandy, no more. So what I do before I have money, right? Then what I did was I print it. I print money. I love doing that. So I go to Google and find myself some money, and I print it. I even laminate it and put it in my wallet because you need to have a lot of money until I really finally have some spare money. Then I really put a real hundred dollar note. However, this is still folded, right? So this one was my last love attraction money time. My money since I kind of use this small trick here and there. It Did raise the vibration, and I did have more money than before that. This right, but I'm upgrading myself. So what I do now is, so I'm transitioning. So then I go from this middle one to I bought myself a blue one because you don't have to get blue, right? Apparently my Feng Shui master. So I'm a fire and earth, and I need water, element of water. So five element. Watch the movie Five Element. So I need blue. This is why I'm like blue all over now because I find blue is my money color. So I need to have blue. I have to maintain my blue. So I got myself a blue wallet. Can put the note straight there, and then all my card at the back, right? So I'm transitioning from this one because it's actually quite small. So when you open the wallet, it's messy. This one is meant to have like you put your phone in here, and then you know just a little bit money here, a bit of card. It's kind of like just go out really quickly for me. And so now because it doesn't have a lot of holding thing, so I have a lot of card just kind of like hanging in there, which is messy. You don't want that. So the point is, right? Money is energy. Everything is energy. Look at your life will mirror back to you what your money and your organization skill, your relationship, your career can actually reflect from small little things. So have a look at if your house is messy. Your Your wallet is messy. Your financial is messy. Your bedroom is messy. Your dieting is messy. Your your lifestyle routine is messy. Then you can pretty much can tell if you want to do something that require not messiness, then you're probably not gonna do very well. So you might have to start from small thing, which is your wallet, right? For example, I have bills. So I just went out shopping post office yesterday, and you know I got some bill and tracking number and receipt. Every night when you go home, clear that out, file it, you know, scan it. 
if you can claim tax in your business, claim this. If the, if it is your leisure, just you know your bill for shopping, chuck it. You don't need that. Or un, un, unless you need to return refund the, the thingy, then you put it in somewhere else, not in your wallet. Okay. Because if you open your wallet and you see a lot of bills or receipt, it looks like money going out, money going out. What you need to do is to make this money going in, going in, come to you. What I now do is oh, one second. Hello, Mali. Mali. Hi, Mali. All right. I'm distracted. Now, what I'm doing is I got a new wallet. Thank you for crypto profit. Otherwise, I wouldn't be paying another 2K for another wallet. So this is a long wallet, has all these compartments. I put cash in it. Like I seriously get like a month or two months salary or something worth of dollar, put it in there. And when you put the money in, right, you need to make sure that they're in order. So they're all facing the same, right? You need to respect the money. Again, money is energy. You need to be like, Mm, I love money. Money loves me. Okay? Because a lot of people out there is like, whoa, cash is dirty. Cash has Rona. No, cash is beautiful. Cash can buy you stuff. Cash will buy you options and freedom. All right. So you need to respect it because money has energy. Think about it. Let's say money has the consciousness. Let's say money is a person. Let's say money is a friend. Okay. So let's say I am money, right? Or you are money. Think about it. If someone said, nah, I don't need no money. Bah! Fuck no money. Nah, I don't need money. Or someone say, hey, I love money. I'll take you to the world. I'll take you travel. I'll buy you stuff. I'll go to restaurant. I'll buy my mom some scarf. I'll buy my dad some something, something. I'll buy my husband this and that because I love money. Money can buy shit. Or the other one was like, meh. I don't need money. I just need happiness. I mean, I'm not mocking like, yes, you need happiness, very important. But money will probably enhance the happiness, make it bigger. Let's say I'm happiness. And then someone say, well, your version of Beyonce gonna have a tour and she will invite you for a whole year following your version of Beyonce, like whoever you like. And the price is 10K. 10K, follow her for a whole year and then everything paid for. That's it. Do you have a spare 10K right now? Just say, there you go, 10K. And do you have the time capacity? I can quit my job or postpone or take a holiday one year to go there. If you can, then that means you are abundance. You have the money, you have the choice, you have the time freedom, you have the money freedom. You're not trapped into a job that you have to work for 52 weeks to get two weeks off, right? Or four weeks off in Australia, like in Hong Kong, seven days, right? Which is Chinese New Year and, and Christmas. So you probably have two days in Hong Kong that you can choose a year to take off. Make sure at the beginning when you get a first wallet, you put some fresh new money in there. Why? Why? Before you use it, right? So because this guy need to eat a lot of money, right? This guy needs to prepare and ready for all the gourmet shit coming to you. This wallet is on training, right? It's trainee. So you have this huge amount of money. Like normally, of course, I don't put this one much money on the street, like, right? Because when you get, even if you get robbed, you just want to get robbed like tiny bit. But now this is a training because the energy or the consciousness of this wallet need to get used to, oh, there's always plenty, always plenty all the time. I'm get used to it. I'm ready. Come on. Come on, feed me, baby. Feed me more. Feed me more. Huge chunk of money in there for, I would say, maybe 21 days or uh, a month, right? Because 21 days will get you a new habit. And just in case the first seven days, you know, you don't feel like it and it's written off, then one month. Then this wallet will become my money magnet wallet very soon. And then when you use your wallet, you need to respect your wallet. Sometimes you clean it and then you go open the money and then you count them. You make sure that they're still looking nice. And and then you put your card in order. Ideally, you don't put too much coin in there to make it too big and chunky and bulky because that would become a clutch, not a wallet. I trust this help. And if you want to hear more of this weird shit or let me know if this is like too out there, this is like nonsense, this is crazy, then just unfollow me. Thank you, thank you.